Alright, yo, what's up guys? Today we are back in Strongest Punch Simulator and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to level up the brand new Mythical Pets Fast Unlock all different types of Mythical Pets. Each stage gives you a better multiplier and each tier will give you a crazy multiplier okay guys so as you can see right now i'm on stage 301 tier 31 every 10 stages it goes up by one tier my hp is 134 sxd my damage is 739 sxd and my power gain is 216 times this is even better than my roblox Rob robux multiplier so this is basically what will make Make the game balanced out because it was pretty paid to win with this robux multiplier so yeah i'm gonna show you guys how you can get all these orbs really fast so as you can see guys there's the glitch where you can look through the look through the wall we have like a shard there then if we go straight we've got some big orbs here we've got another orb right there which is actually really close to the side of the wall um but as you can see, at this world right now, I literally can't do any damage to the wall. No matter how hard I'm punching this thing, I am just doing... I'm doing no damage to the wall. As you guys can see, it's just doing no damage. So, therefore, I can't get any orbs. So, what I'd recommend doing first is going ahead and going to your second best world. Because, as you can see, at this world, I can do crazy amounts of damage. And now, I look through the wall and... Oh my god, no way. There's a cube right here look at this boys right there 26 qi and then i can literally just go straight here and get a ton of stages like right there we literally just got a new ev evolution of the pet we literally just got a whole new evolution as you can see now we do the same thing again we look around bruh there's another cube these are the cubes, by the way, guys. And there we go. 36 QI. That is not enough for another uh, stage. But then we do the same thing again. We look around, see if we can see any more. There's a big orb right here, which is actually pointing out. So we can literally just pick that up like that. Um, and then you just keep going around. Like, say, there's big orbs over here. I can just run at them. Then I can keep punching, looking for different orbs. And as you can see, we are getting absolutely tons of orbs right here. Like, right here, just from that one, 50 QA, 50 QA. And then we just do this over and over and over again. And then when you have enough strength, you can start farming at your next best world. Like, right now, my best world is so hard to farm map because i literally just unlocked it so if i do want to farm here then i'd have to sit here for like five or ten minutes just auto clicking at the wall to get my damage up a little bit then i would actually be able to go ahead and start picking up orbs and then once you're able to pick up orbs then it gets way easier because the orbs at your best world will give so much more damage so then it will make you evolve way faster which will increase your orbs um because the better world the better orbs you get you also have your um your like super rebirths i guess you could call them and what they will do is your prestige every 10 worlds i think it is you get a prestige and for each prestige it will make you way 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 more op so i believe there was a prestige at world 10 and then there's a prestige at world 21 so i'm only one world away from my next prestige and then i'm assuming it will be 31 41 51 61 like that um and i don't actually know what the highest world is right now but i'm up to here so far and all you guys basically need to do is go ahead and do the glitch by using shift lock to look through the wall and then once you're doing this you can just look around find any you know cubes or big orbs like over here there's a big orb right there then we can go ahead and pick that up Right now, I'm getting close to actually getting the next one. And at the start, guys, it's actually really easy. You can get, like, the first 100 tiers really easy. Not the first 100 tiers. The first 100 stages really easily. So if you guys are planning on playing this game, then I definitely recommend playing it now. Because, like, I don't know if these mythical pets are only going to be a limited thing or if they're in the game forever. Um... 
Hopefully they do balance out the Robux multiply though or like take it out or make it cost like orbs or something Because if they made it cost orbs then the Robux multiply would be so much like um, more balanced Because some people can just go ahead and spend like 50k Robux like Russo did and instantly be super duper OP at the game So like that's probably um, Something that they should consider doing in the future uh, But yeah, if you guys have any any friends that can help you get through the worlds really fast say you have a friend that's really OP say you're at world 20 they're at world 30 they can come back to world 20 destroy the whole area for you and then you can just run around picking up every single orb that's on the ground and then that's how you could get a load of tears as well just basically by doing that I'm not sure if there's actually a game pass for orbs let me just check that quickly uh, yes, there is double orbs the hunter and the double walk speed Okay, so there is a double orbs game pass for 500 robux Which I'm not gonna buy to be honest because I don't play the game enough right now to buy that But if I did start grinding this game properly in the future, then I probably would um, But that's double orbs. So that'll make your your um, your evolutions way more as you can see, I'm at 310 right now, so I'm pretty sure if I had double orbs right now, I would be at um, 620, which would be pretty crazy, to be honest. That would actually be crazy. I'd be at like tier 60 something, and my multiplier would literally be in the millions, but um, it's pretty expensive. It's like £5 for a Game Pass um, which is actually quite expensive also if you guys uh, do watch my anime fighters videos make sure you guys are grinding that because there is a double or not double 1.5 times yen event right now which I've been grinding I've got like 300 trillion yen right now so make sure you guys are grinding that because it is very very OP uh, from how I've been grinding it but yeah as you can see just keep going through breaking everything you see and collecting all the orbs that you see on the ground at your second best world unless you're like really good at your best world and you're about to get to the next one um but go through like this keep doing that and then that should get you enough and then once your pets leveled up even more then you can just go start grinding at your next world and then you can just repeat that process over and over again and then as you can see the world the terrain will get regened and then the orbs will spawn back and then we can just go repeat the same process go through have a look around see if there's any more cubes like there's two more big orbs right here so i'll collect them and that will give me a ton more right there and then we go around again there's another big orb here that just spawned in so we can quickly go grab that and then just keep doing this over and over again the only bad thing about this game is you can't really afk it but like that's different to most roblox games so i actually kind of like that but it is bad for some people but it does make the game more balanced for say like mobile users and stuff like that because you can't really afk that well on mobile so it makes it more balanced i guess um but yeah my one tip that i would say is is definitely recommend the developers to um, kind of nerf the uh, Robux multiplier. Uh, but yeah, let's quickly go ahead and get this multiplier, see how much stats the pet goes up by, just to show you guys how much stats each uh, uh, evolution actually makes your pet way more OP. So let's, let's how much do we actually need? 47.7. Okay, let me grab 47.7 and I will show you guys how much more OP these multipliers make your pets because it's pretty crazy how much stats they go up by each time. Um, I've looked myself and it's actually insane. So let's go 40... 47.2, 47.5, let's grab 47.7, make sure you guys are looking for the cubes though, the cubes are the best one by far, so there's the small orbs, the medium orbs, the big orbs, and then there's the shards, and there's the cubes, the cubes are smaller than shards, but they give more than shards, and they're rarer than shards, they're quite hard to spot though, so make sure you're on the lookout for them, um, but yeah, there we go, let's see, it goes from 250, 28, and 5, 
to 742 and 256. Bruh, that's literally one multiplier right there. Just made us so much more OP. And maybe I can make a tiny dent in this wall now. Um, no, not even a tiny dent. Uh, but yeah, hope you guys do enjoy today's video. If you did, make sure to drop a fat like, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, guys.